Hello guys, this is DBL Engineering Revit tutorial. On this tutorial, I'm going to share on how to create a hatch in Revit. So let's get started. I'm going to open my existing model here. Then go to floor plan. My client want me to make a 600 by 600 granite tile and he want my hatch to be scaled. So First, go to annotate, detail line, make a 600 by 600 hatch here. Okay, copy it. Then highlight my detail line here. Go to my Revit, then make pattern. I'm going to name my pattern as a 600 by 600 mm granite then i choose my pattern type as a model pattern and scale multiplier as 1.0 then create pattern click both edge here first corner then ok then i'm going to delete my pattern then highlight your slab here your slab edit type then edit, then insert new function here. Structure, I'm going to name this as finish one. I'm going to make a thickness of 50 mm. Then change mater my material. I'm going to choose a granite type here. Granite. Then I'm going to use a stone natural solder here. Then change my foreground pattern. Go to model and going to locate my granite here. So okay and okay. So that's it. If you are going to check the dimension of my pattern here, so it is 600 by 600. Other one, go to rear elevation. So I want this wall here to have a CHB pattern so first I'm going to unhide my my crop region here and just this then I'm going to make a CHB pattern here so detail line going to make a 200 by 400 copy here In a line here, little line, then highlight it again. Go to PyRevit, make a pattern, name this as a CHB or a 400 by or 200 by. 400 mm CHP. Okay, I am going to choose a modern pattern under pattern type and scale of 1.0. Great pattern. Click the corner here, two corners, then okay. Delete the created pattern here. Then delete your wall, then edit type, edit, change the function as the finish here. Then material, I'm going to find the masonry. So this is the masonry here. Okay, this is the masonry. Then your pattern, load the your created pattern here. So let's load our 200 by 400 mm CHB. Okay. okay. Then okay. After that, let's check our pattern here. Did I mention? Annotate. Right. So it's 200 by 200. Last one. I'm going to my detail here. So at this rate, I'm going to make a gravel pattern here. So I'm going to move this one. And my dimension here. 
So I am going to create a gravel here, gravel bedding here. A 100 fm gravel bedding. So I am going to create a gravel pattern. So, an ellipse. All one. More spline. That's it. After that, I'm going to highlight my pattern here. I'm going to move. Then, go to PyRevit. Make a pattern. Name it a gravel. Ready. Then, choose my pattern as a detail pattern. So, in this case, I'm going to choose as a detail pattern. Then, create a pattern. Then point it to edge here or corners. Okay. And I'm going to make annotate region. After that, I'm going to make a 100 deep gravel. Then after that, edit type, duplicate. I'm going to name this a gravel bedding. Okay, then go to foreground fill pattern at the drafting. So choose the gravel bedding here. Okay, then okay, check it, and that's okay. So that's great. So thank you for watching my tutorial. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel.